revealed how Meghan Markle has broken royal taboo and changed monarchy forever. The arrival of Meghan Markle into the royal family has had a huge impact on the monarchy. In the last important royal wedding for a generation, Prince Harry's wife Meghan Markle is the first biracial divorcee ever to marry a member of the British royal family. Their iconic marriage ceremony was blessed by Queen Elizabeth II and has made the monarchy appear more inclusive and relevant in an ever-changing world. Edward VIII, the Duke of Windsor, who gave up his throne in 1936 so that he could marry a twice-divorced American was prevented from making the love of his life his queen because Wallace had two former husbands who were still alive at the time the scandal shook the stability of the nation, and Edward and Wallace forever haunted Queen Elizabeth's reign. In the 1950s, the Queen's younger sister Princess Margaret faced the same situation, choosing royal duty before her love for the divorced Captain Peter Townsend. It is well known that royals are not supposed to be allowed to marry divorcees without special dispensation from the Queen. And in royal biographer Andrew Morton's book on the Duchess of Sussex, Morton discusses how divorces in the monarchy is no longer taboo and could be argued that it is more widely accepted in the 21st century. Even in the early 80s the notion of a divorced American marrying into the royal family was unthinkable. Prince Charles had found Lady Diana Spencer, a white Anglo-Saxon Protestant aristocratic virgin to be his wife, even though it did end in a catastrophe of a divorce. According to Mr. Morton, this caused the older generation of royals to take pause before commenting on the chosen companions of the younger members of the family. Other royal divorces included, Princess Anne and the Queen's beloved son, Prince Andrew all split from their marital partner since the romantic trauma surround Edward VIII and Princess Margaret, the royal family, like the rest of the world, have accepted the fact that divorce no longer carries the social stigma it once did. Morton claims that Meghan, having divorced after a brief two-year union with the film producer hardly raised an eyebrow, let alone created a constitutional crisis. After all, Prince Charles is a divorcee who married his former mistress, Camilla Parker Bowles, who is also divorced. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.